so I was very, very honored to be able to play a part in this uh, in this film. Um, in this political climate, to, to have something like this in, you know, kind of like a bite-sized, like, you know, consumable, entertaining form is, I think, is just a very, really useful tool for changing people's minds. How, and I know how important it is, and I know how important this type of story is to tell, and it's important to get this story heard and as much as possible. So. She's one of the ones that will be most affected by Mark's death. Uh, Kate, she is um, uh, the, his uh, girlfriend. And through those interactions, we begin to kind of see um, Mark as like uh, a person who who has dependence kind of. She depends, Kate depends on Mark emotionally for, you know, support and just, you know, it's a legitimate love that they share. And so she, when, um, yeah, it's just, I think it makes the story hit harder. Um, when we know about their relationship. B is the embodiment of female white privilege. Uh, but she is more than just that. You know, she um, she's a woman who loves her husband and he has a wandering eye and that really hurts her. Really deep down inside of her, that really hurts her. And she just, she wants to be liked by others. She. Uh, she's a bit of a show off. She tries to show off how she likes to donate all of her money and um, she gets a lot of her self-esteem from the outside world. But she, you know, on the darker side, she just doesn't seem to understand that people who don't look like her have a lot of value.